Hello, hello, I'm Kendra, I love to watch, this is the weekly watch list, and today we are reacting to X-Men 97, Episode 4, Montendo, and Life Death Part 1. Let's get into it. Blah, 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 blah. I'm Kendra, I love to watch, and this morning we are watching X-Men, we're catching up on X-Men 97, which is the reboot of the original 90s series uh, that I watched when I was a kid but can't remember any of. I'm really loving rediscovering these characters, rediscovering why I love them so much when I was a kid. There have been so many, you know, reboots and remakes and things. I generally really liked those movies, you know, they were hit or miss, but for the most part I liked them. Um, you know, Halle Berry is Storm, like I said, was hit or miss, um, but it really made the world darker. I mean, I'll, I'll say grittier, but uh, but this is this can be gritty in its own way. But it just changed um, the way that the X-Men were presented to us, and so rediscovering them in this way, you know, in this saturated color and this amazing music and these you know the the drama and the 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 deep <laughs> you know uh theatrics of the characters is really it's good stuff i really like it i'm ready to watch this episode it's called life death uh it looks like we might be getting more jubilee and that other guy well which is something that i was interested in seeing more of so let's see what happens with her and what is going to happen with magneto as a leader moving forward he seems to be genuinely doing right by the X-Men. I know, you know, he's an advocate for mutants, but it is interesting seeing a former villain just chilling in the mansion. Just I tried to kill you so many times, but I'm your leader now. It's cool. Let's have some coffee. Anyway, uh, so let's see what's going down and what is going on with Storm. Is she going to get her powers back, please? She has to. Of course she's going to get her powers back. And this Forge guy seems like the guy. Hopefully. Okay, let's go. You haven't found a little extra. Aw, oh, thanks, Remy. But our new boss beat you to the pot. It's three sugars. I'll take a cappuccino. Look at Magneto showing off. Taking orders. No, I am giving them. <laughs> After breakfast, the X-Men will report to the danger <laughs> room for drills. We must be ready should Mr. Sinister resurface. Surely our youngest member deserves some... They should be proactive and, like, birthday. actually searching for him. I second the blue Rogaine ad. Yo! Someone's daddy didn't get him a pony for his sweet 16. My parents perished when I was a child. Yeah, you don't want to talk about childhood, Who's got childhood, two thumbs bro. of blast fireworks and turns 18 today? Me. Boy, do we got some surprises for you. But first, how do you want to celebrate the big 18th, huh? We are all ears. Let's go to the arcade. It'll be just like old times. They have two old and grown for the arcade. And so is Magneto. Look, you don't want to do that. This is bogus. What's wrong with just one day where I don't have to freak out about the professor or Jean and her clone or Cyclops and his latest control issue? They just had to go play mutant politics at the United <laughs> Nations. Genosha entering the UN. Why do they need to be involved in your birthday, baby? Go do whatever you want. I'm the birthday Big Mac. You actually do play video games? The only people who hate video games are bad at video games. No. But actually, this one is I'm bad at video games, but I I've never them. even heard of a Motendo. Oh, what? Rogue said they had some surprises. Uh. Days looking up. Let's play. <laughs> Whoa, what's it doing? Motendo. This is hilarious. But seriously, how did that get in her room? And they just sit around. Oh, we'll just wait for Sinister to show up. You should be finding him. Look at this. It's cool though. What time is it? How long were we playing? Hey! Oh shit! Whoa! Where'd the mansion go? Oh boy! Oh, look at that! He's looking at him like, hey, baby. I don't got time for that. Okay. We need something a little heavier, Jubilee. No offense, baby. I love you, but where's the firepower? Where's the solar power? You know, it would be a lot easier if you just used your Thank powers. Thank you. What if there's cameras around? Okay. I want to like it, but I do like the music. Wait a second. It could be a trap. A phone booth trap? That'd be creative. Hello? 
Okay, maybe it was a way out. I don't know. Whoa, hold up. Like way back when, you know? Wow. I was trapped here with Storm, Gambit too, and a bunch of other mutants, all enslaved to build by Bolivar Trask. The dude who created the Sentinels? Oh! Huh. Oh! Is are, is are, is she just like going down memory lane or something? Was that you, Hot Topic Stalker, <laughs> calling us earlier on the phone? Hot Topic Stalker. Oh. Okay. Like a cyberpunk mirage. <laughs> Jubilee is pretty funny. He's totally cute. Totally in a video game. Were what? Pay attention to the young. Oh! Like what the heck is that guy? What in the name of all heaven is that? Yeah. Mojo, oh. your prime time psycho interdimensional alien TV producer who feeds off rating. My greatest hit? Putting the X Men through overly complicated death traps to entertain my slaves! <laughs> Indentured audiences, sorry! Looks like you've been dieting? You noticed! Got some nap, some talk. Ah, thirsty for the next big thing, dirty girl. Well, that's why I'm This guy's hilarious. <laughs> the future of mind numbering. Oh, You're not just in a video game, honey. You're the star. Okay. My first blockbuster release where every level is based off your own memories. Don't ask. So you're my gamer girl in a gamer world. You connect with the youth. <laughs> the future of Nintendo, that's Mo for Mojo, in every home. On every world, in every dimension. <laughs> Zapping up nom 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 energy from the brains of all who play. I'll dominate the galaxies and the 18 to 45 age demographic. And what if we refuse to play your game? Oh, I don't want to say something scary, like if you die in the game, you die in real life, but... Stakes. Aha! Be young forever, replay the golden hits. <laughs> Think about it, Jews. Storm, different wow. worlds. Divorce court, Summers versus Greg. <laughs> not Summers versus Greg. <laughs> You're my X-Men, Jubilee, so... Game on! I mean, of course it would be Jubilee. And this is very cyberpunk, I love it. It's very, um, I, I, again, not to age myself, but it's very Tron. Tron meets X-Men. Go! Go! This is so cute. old base from his megalomaniacal face. I acted like I hated mutants. Yeah, mine tried saying they were good ones, but I could tell she was spooked. So I said they're all freaks and normal people would win. Man, talk about simpler times. Now Helmet Head's bossing us around and telling me how to spend my birthday. I should probably find a way out of here. What's the rush? What's the rush, girl? Y'all in danger by like an intergalactic enemy. You gotta grow up. Otherwise reality will smack you right oh, in the face. <laughs> Like that. Oh no! Roberto's health is almost gone! Yeah! I just need to wait for it to cycle. One more. Is the spiral chick happening? Oh, okay. How did that get in there? Spiral! Was I dead? Oh, I found that's an extra so cute. life. Someone is definitely helping us. Still, this young lady did take down old Magneto. Bow before the Lord of Magneto. Are you sure about that? Hey! Oh! <laughs> Thank you among friends. And by friends, I mean you. I hacked you out of the game servers to buy us some time. Is in league with Mojo. This, this is Acosta. 
Oh wait, is that future Jubilee? Like I said, we go way back. Oh shit! That's fucking cool. I got a few yeah, questions. pause that shit. Explain everything. You gotta test a game before launch. Mojo needed beta testers. I'm the only one left. I've played these levels inside and out, but note the uh, hair and wrinkles. Figures my game has cheat codes. Very me. <laughs> it's nice knowing how every stage ends. No surprises, no twists. It no always deaths. stays the same. That you That's don't not remember. living. Living doesn't get cheat codes, but it has. This is a very nice love lesson. Loss. Life's a total risk, and it's on you. Yep. Take it. It's a total risk, and it's on you. Take the so, risk, girl. Magneto was right a bit. But he's totally wrong about one thing. Video games rule. They totally do. Look at Magneto teaching lessons and shit and helping the kids, the children. I guess, well, I guess Xavier was right. Uh, maybe you should stop waiting on the sidelines and actually help me, girl. Shit. Why are you still watching? What's the test? about risk okay finally some kind of something going on with them dorm dinner is ready oh so this is like a two part so the first one was one dot one ten one dindo bison chili bison chili whoa spices to do their magic Okay, Forge. Um, don't be time. too handsome, sir. Well, a friend of Charles Xavier is a friend of mine. How does it work? A mutant who can invent anything he can conceive. I can wow. give it parts of the brain that are normally dormant in humans, like a Rubik's Cube on constant autopilot. Or wow. simply a genius. Well, yeah. life and love. God help me. Things life and love. Because I'm sensing some chemistry here. Chili. <laughs> uh -huh. chili. Then I'm your man. Okay. Was this a thing in the comments? May oh, I'm intrigued. I, I ship it, baby. I ship it. There was a war. I miss soaring. The wind in my hair, so powerful it's hard to breathe, but so fresh is to be worth it. Let's go for a ride. Okay, officially totally like Forge. Oh, is he giving her that experience again? Kind of. Looks like you got creative. Keep up. What a rude little man. Uh-huh. And she's like, all right, keep up. I'm gonna smoke you. Oh, shit. <gasps> no! Uh, Storm, don't <laughs> fall off a smooth. cliff. That owl, I've seen him before circling. The winds here never shift. They always blow east. Stuck like this owl. Maybe the owl's not stuck. Maybe he just uh, likes picture. being in it. East blowing wind. The real trick to reversing what the executioner did to you wasn't making an inverted version of its radiation. Oh. Ah, you've been listening. Last power differential clicked in my head when we were out riding. You ready? It's okay, Storm. Winds? Heed my command. I am Storm, mistress of the elements. Rise, winds, and move the desert sands. Oh, well, I think that's just a win, baby. Please. Winds, hear me. Why is this always making me so Please. emotional? Oh, no. Oh. It can't be real. I know, Aurora. I know. You're still working on the machine. Why is fixing me so important to you? Because I love mm. you, girl. After the war. I didn't have the resources to build what I so easily saw in my mind. 
The Defense Department offered to help oh. Devices that could be used to neutralize dangerous mutants. Oh, this is where the weapons came. No, no, oh, no. shit! You made these? You, of all people, should know the perils of trusting those in Washington. I was hurting, lost, bitter. If I told you the truth in Dallas, you wouldn't have let me help you. My weaver of lies. It hasn't all been lies. Damn, I was really interested this, in that chemistry. Oh. This is not a lie. No. Oh. Don't you dare. Oh. I could live forever, and still my endless imagination would never conceive of a thing as perfect as you. Oh. A perfect path to your redemption. She's you got a point. A goddess. Powers be damned. I don't know. Her Look, connection to her powers is pretty place. pivotal to this her place. character, though, bro. Then you can go or you can stay, but I love you. How? Oh, I knew it. Oh! <laughs> Instead, you have fashioned a fool. Yes, yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma <laughs> <laughs> Girl, I do not blame you. I do not blame you one little bit. Who is that? That's sinister. Oh shit! What the f what what? How, how the fuck did she get back there? What? How did I return here? The fuck is going on? What? <gasps> what? What the fuck is that? By all things in the heavens! You damn demon! Oh! Shit just got real! Death? No. Oh. You live trapped here, haunted. I feast on misery. Oh. And I, the adversary, shall not waste my meal. Oh! Wowie Kazawi, what was that? I love that episode um, a lot more than I thought I would. I'm gonna rank it an eight out of ten. Let's talk about it. Yeah, all right. <laughs> oh, good. <laughs> wow, like I was gonna rate this episode a seven and a half because while I enjoyed the Jubilee part and the lesson about, you know, living life and not being afraid of it. But then we cut to Storm and this dude Forge, who it turns out conceived of the early prototype designs that led to the weapon that took away Storm's powers. Like, whoa. After this, you know, buildup of the chemistry between them and it's like, oh, there's feelings here, obviously, clearly. Oh, but then this bombshell drops. And then after that, we get another bombshell where this thing that calls itself the adversary, I think, is feasting on her pain and misery and was about to, what the, do what the fuck, I don't know, but that was fucking scary as shit, I'll tell you that. I really love this show. I'm gonna I'm gonna give that an eight out of ten. That was really good. Cannot wait to see the next episode. I guess it'll be part two. Hopefully it'll be part two of Life Death. So I guess the, the episode is Montendo and Life Death Part One. Really, really good show so far. I'm so glad this is number three on my watch list. It has been in the back of my mind since I started watching the ones who live, but I just didn't have time to get to it but now I do and I'm so excited so yeah this has been X-Men week I cannot wait to uh, finish with the rest of the episode so be on the lookout for another X-Men week if you like what you see please like the video and subscribe and keep up with what I'm watching so you can watch with me all right see you later guys peace